Broken Flowers, a Jim Jarmusch film with Bill Murray in it. It's about this a computer tycoon that gets a typewritten letter that's all pink that tells me he has a son. So fast forward, he talks to his buddy. He gets this whole thing figured out. He's going to go find every woman that he's ever had a fling with to figure out who is the mother. So, I mean, the first thing I want to talk about is the symbolism and the misend scene in these movie in this movie is it's great. You know, the shots that are like leading up to a house he's going to, it's just a shot of the house. It's like a like 10 second shot, you're just looking at the house. So I love that. I love shots like that. Like the ones where you're just like, oh. and scene change. Anyway, 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 anyway. So, first house gets there, knocks on the door, gives it the old, and it walks in, and it's just this naked, almost naked 17 year old girl. And we're just like, whoa, like what the fuck? And I think that's supposed to symbolize the relationship that he had with the woman. I, I think that was the major thing in symbolism is every, every interaction he has with this woman kind of symbolizes the past interactions they've had. So I'm assuming this one was very, you know, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of sex, pretty much for lack of a better term. I feel like there was a lot of sex. Anyway, talks to her. She doesn't have a typewriter. She doesn't really like pink. And he's like, all right, this can't be her. So moves on. Next woman right there. Uh, very bland, very, very like I don't I don't know. She's like a picture of flowers right above a picture or right above the exact same flowers are in the picture. It's just really weird. But there's pink everywhere, and so he sits down and has dinner with her. Shooter McGavin's in it. If you didn't know, Shooter McGavin from uh, Happy Gilmore. He's the dad. He's the husband of the bland woman. Anyway, kind of she doesn't have a typewriter. Kind of realizes it's not her. So he goes moves on to the next woman. It's, She's also kind of weird. She's like a dog whisperer or some shit. Not her. Like, she doesn't have a typewriter. Then the last woman's just in this, like, trailer park with the crazy guy. But she has a pink typewriter. And you're thinking, hey, this could be this could be it. My son, His son's out there looking for him, and he's asking her, hey, do, do you have a son? And she just freaks out. Anyway, moving on from that, like, I love this film. And... It, 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 the ending ends with him talking to who he thinks is his son because his son's been out looking for him. He They're eating a sandwich together, and then he mentions, hey, I think of your dad, and his son just loses it, runs away. And, I mean, I, you know, <laughs> but the, the ending shot is of him just staring down the street watching his son run away. And we never really find out if he truly had a son or not. In the end, it like, He's thinking it might could the could have been a joke could have been not like it who knows, but one of my another one of my favorite uh, symbolism scenes in the movie is uh, he's sitting on the bus and there's these two like teenage girls just gawking over this like really handsome dude off in the corner and he's wearing almost the identical shit to what Bill Murray's wearing and I think that's like obviously supposed to symbolize him and his youth but what I'm thinking it doesn't make any sense because he's like a computer genius so I'm thinking he's like he's kind of nerdy like that I'm thinking maybe that's supposed to symbolize what he thought he was back in the day and not really what he was but I don't know I, I loved that scene but anyway the miss end scene was huge like I said the shots of like the car coming up or like the house and there, it was huge the miss end scene was huge but anyway yeah broken flowers Great flick, watch it. I loved it. Give it two thumbs up. Give it three thumbs up if I had a third thumb. Um, yeah, there's, it was crazy. It was a crazy film. Really a weird ending, but it was an ending that you kind of expected because I don't know it's a Bill Murray movie. They could they always end kind of weird. But yeah, thank you.